Hey guys, it's me, Inez Moore, and today I am going to show you how I do a wash and go on my baby's hair. Uh, well, toddler, because she's 12 months old now. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so she's 12 months old now, and she's just gotten out the bath. And um, I co-washed her hair with um, this As I Am Cleansing Co-Wash. And in my last video, I stated that I used the Johnson & Johnson's. But since then, for, I want to say for about a month and a half now, she's been using this. Um, because she's no longer what I consider like a small baby. Um, so I feel more comfortable using um, this on her, this co-wash on her hair, which is not very harsh on her hair. Um, of course, I still use my whipped shea butter. Um, let me get it so I can show you guys. A lot of people, it's called everything butter. A lot of people have been asking about my shea butter video. I've taken it down because I do sell my shea butter on Etsy. I'll leave the link below um, for you guys who wants to purchase this for your baby's hair. Um, but I use it on my hair and I use it on her hair as well. This is pretty much the only product that I use in her hair, um, especially when I'm braiding. And as you can see, it moisturizes her hair very well. I'm going to start out by moisturizing her hair in sections. So I just take a little bit and... I just work it through sections. Now, when I did wash her hair, um, I did detangle it in the shower, so there's no need for me to use combs for this process. So I'm just gently working it in her hair. <laughs> this is why you have to have toys around when you are doing your baby's hair, because you have to have something to keep your baby occupied. So I'm going to just continue to moisturize her hair using my fingers to detangle. So whenever you do do a wash and go on your baby's hair, um, you want to make sure that it's detangled very well because you don't want any knots to happen. I, I don't do a lot of wash and goes on her hair because as you can see, um, her hair is pretty thick. She has a lot of hair and I just don't want her hair to get a lot of knots. And you want to do it in the direction that you want your um, hair to go into. So I want her hair to go into um, the direction, this direction. So I'm just continuing to work my product through. And because I'm going to have her hair slick back like this. I'm going to go ahead and work this back a little bit. Just like that. I'm going to slick it some more. And I'm going to take a piece just like that where I've slicked it and I'm going to twist it and now I'm just adding the bow just like that pretty much it her hair um, does look a little bit white but that will go away here it still has to dry and that is pretty much it so this is the completed look so here is the completed look. <laughs> so if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask and thanks for watching. Say bye bye. This is why hats and babies never work. <laughs> hats and babies just don't work. You gonna put your hat off your head? Huh?